Hi, Rincon Mountain Presbyterian Church. This is Mark Bocanegra. I am an MTW missionary and pastor at Kaihimakari Grace Church, serving in Chiba, Japan, uh, with my wife and four kids. Um, thank you for praying for us as we have, as you know, uh, been grieving uh, the death of the founding pastor of Kaihimakari Grace Church, Pastor uh, Yoshinobu Hirohashi. Uh, but we have pre three praises um, for you all. Uh, first, we're just so thankful how the Lord has um, given us a smooth transition from Hirohashi Sensei and also um, preparing us, uh, preparing the congregation well for our um, HMA in July. We were able to call a new um, assistant pastor and a church sec secretary. We were able to mo move out of our um, old um, apartment where we've been worshiping for 20 years into a new apartment. We also have been able to do the final um, milestone uh, for the grieving process of Hirohashi Sensei. On March 25, uh, Josiah and myself did the final uh, internment ceremony, as, they, uh, as you say in English, I think, uh, where we put the remains of Hirohashi Sensei in a Christian columbarium. Um, so we're just thankful for how the Lord has provided um, in, in this um, hard time. But we also are thankful again for the, the just the growth that the Lord provides just out of nowhere. Um, first, we had we will and had a um, baptisms this spring, a, a child and a, a woman. I can't get into the details, but just powerful testimonies of how the Lord works. Um, we also again out of nowhere um, got a church intern who's a 25 year old bilingual. Um, seminary student um, who actually hopes to do seminary in the U.S. and at Westminster, California so that he can become a pastor in the PCJ. And we also have two new uh, international families um, who just discovered us um, online and they are encountering the Reformed faith for the first time and joining a Presbyterian church for a first time. So we're just so thankful for how the Lord provides these new opportunities. We're also very thankful uh, personally as well. Um, we are thankful for just housing uh, for us um, in two ways. So as missionaries, we are constantly moving from apartment to apartment and moving takes a lot of um, costs, a lot of time, a lot of energy. But um, thankfully the Lord provided us a kind of a permanent um, place in the literally in the center of Baytown. Uh, Baytown is the the, the city, the residential area that you see behind me, but we're just thankful for that. Um, we have we have now a kind of a ministry base that will not change uh, for many years to come. But also, we are thankful for a missionary um, residence that allow is allowing us to stay uh, starting um, in July uh, for a six for a six month HMA. So, and that, that uh, place is fully furnished. Um, we don't have to bring not much stuff. So we're just so thankful again for how the Lord provides for that in, in those kinds of ways. Um, but again, please praise with us as, as you hear this report. But lastly, we just are excited um, for us to be, to go return to, uh, to the U.S. I hope to visit uh, Rincon Mountain Presbyterian Church again and uh, hope to see you all and give you this report in person. Thank you and, and blessings.